Here we're looking at uh, our stock and focus, and it's Facebook here. I think because there's a lot of good values here. Not only is it in the news because it missed its, uh, you know, missed its second quarter. It had a, posted a second quarter loss here, uh, and people are really selling it. But it's a very, very valuable lesson, in my opinion. Um, you know, I think if you think of stocks, a lot of times how you would. Um, other issues, you know, say for example, um, you know, do you ever hear the uh, the term "don't fall in love with the stock" or, you know, um, "don't be married to the stock"? It what it really calls for is calls for you to not be blinded by your uh, your evaluation of what a company is going to do because, or you know, don't be so far invested in a company because you play with it on your own. It's on, you, hey, I'm on it all the time, and they've they've got to be doing really well, and they have to go higher. Um, it doesn't have to do any of those things, and this is why it's very very important to understand uh, price action, and it really can be of uh, incredible value uh, to traders here. Um, and what the most important thing is that is that price does not lie here. Um, you can have and, and when you fall into the I love the stock and it must go higher. That is where you really are going to lose, in my opinion, because you're never always going to be right with that. And if the price action doesn't reflect that, you're in denial. And it's kind of like a bad relationship, you know, and you just don't want to see the person for what they are. And you just, you know, no matter what, who tells you what, you just don't want to look at it objectively. And charting and, and investing always has to be looked at objectively because you could always be wrong. And when you, you listen to when I do a commentary, a lot of times I'll give you, you know, I give you kind of both sides. And some people say, wow, what, you know, why, you know, what can't you just be sure it's going to do this one thing? I always have to give you that other, you know, potential of what it can do because it can do both um, the difference is the probabilities could be edged more to one one side here but they can always do more than one kind of thing there's always one type of uh, multiple ways that, that the chart or the or the situation could go anyway enough of this but let me just get back to Facebook here um, you know if you keep that in mind with what I said and not fall fall for uh, how terrific Facebook is you can see right off the bat as it opens it can't sustain the rally closes toward the low that's your first indication that this is going lower then you see the gap down that's your next indication. It's going to continue lower, and it's not going to just stop with that bar. Then you see the the continuation of this, and then you see the attempt. Where is it attempt to go? Tries to break through this range, but it can't because that's...